Hello, friends. Welcome to Tabletop Tonight. I'm Ruel Gaviolas, my lovely wife, Michelle. Hello, welcome. We got a couple of pugs in here, too. Um, they may or may not be joining us. I have a feeling they they want to. Well, Meeple does. I don't know about Mookie. Uh, but I want to thank everyone for hanging out. Uh, a little bit of a late start tonight. What we're doing, super chill stream. We're just going to be building our R2, uh, Lego R2, uh, continuing that. We're on bag 11 of 13. We got through about halfway through bag 11 last time when we decided to stop. And now we're going to finish up bag 11, maybe start bag 12. And here comes Mookie. Hi, Mooks. Say hi. Hi to your friends. Mookie. Uh, Spandex says, I would, uh, again, I wanted to absolutely... Um, Spandex says, we're about to hit the six-month anniversary of losing their Bailey and Bruno mm. quick confession and still struggling to be ready to adopt new pups. Yeah. Um, you know, grief is uh, not a linear process. You know, um, some days are going to be worse than others. Uh, you can feel fine for a few weeks and then it'll hit you. Uh, it's been like that with us. Um, yeah. It is now five months uh, since our Bruno passed. And uh, we, we felt we were ready. Um, we had mourned. Um, we, we still mourn. We, we think about Bruno all the time. And we actually, we like to think, and I, I said in the comment here, um, we like to think of uh, Bruno being a uh, Meeple and Mookie's guardian angel pug. So we definitely need to keep an eye on this one here. Mookie is a character, a little rascal. This is the active one, the very, very active one. Yeah. But he's Meeple. such a cuddle bug. Once you got yeah. him in his in your lap, mm -hmm. and he'll just he'll just chill. Yeah, good right boy. Here. Come here, Meeple. You want to join the party? Meeple's uh, sort of inspecting the the, uh, the studio here. But uh, again, I uh, want to say hello to everyone. Hello, GB Glazer. Thanks for the Lurk fan to Meeple, uh, TVMD. I uh, appreciate you. Uh, good to see you all here. And uh, again, uh, some of you watched uh, earlier on uh, Rado's uh, channel, the r and show. Thank you for joining back here. This is not board games. I mean, we, we will talk board games, of course, because we're sitting in the studio. But uh, we're going to just hang out and uh, do our R2-D2 Lego set. So, um, <clears throat> excuse me. Do you want to shout out who else was here earlier? Was this, are there all these comments from this chat? I mean, this Yeah, yeah well, like uh, we had an extended uh, start, starting uh, soon. Ah, story. gotcha. Yeah. But I had a lot of fun uh, today with uh, Rado uh, going over our top 100 games. We are on numbers 50. We did 50 through 41. And there, there's been some really, uh, uh, really great games. And um, it, it's neat to see how uh, he's like such a Euro uh, gamer. And I'm definitely more of an Omni gamer. Uh, so it's nice to see the different uh, games. And, you know, I just, number 42 on my list was Crokinole, you know, and it's like you know, all-time favorite. It's not number one? Not number one. <laughs> number one dexterity game. I said it's the greatest dexterity okay. game of all time. But um, it's not, it's neat to see uh, how our paths uh, diverge. Supreme YD and AC is here. Thank you for joining us. Yeah, uh, folks, uh, this is Mookie. And hopefully Meeple will uh, join us soon. Um, Spandex says, hi, Mookie. <laughs> <laughs> Steve would be, oh, thank you. Thank you uh, for saying that. That really does mean a lot. Uh, TVFD says, uh, thank you for giving Mookie and Meeple a loving home. Yeah, they are they are well loved. And um, if we could, I would have brought all the pugs. I know. Ooh. Yeah, there's, oh, Pug Nation Rescue LA. I, now, I, I didn't, we haven't really talked about this, but I will say this on air. But I feel like, remember when Bruno passed, we had said, hey, we should do something to honor Bruno, mm -hmm. like a charity stream or something. Mm -hmm. I feel like, now that we have Mookie and Meeple in our family, we should do a charity stream and raise funds for Pug Nation Rescue. Oh, absolutely. You know, and maybe one other, I, I would like to combine that with another um, charity that, you know, like provides food for, you know, people who, um, who are not uh, housed at the moment. Yeah. Okay. And Here is Meeple. Yeah. Meeple and Mookie. Okay, this one is the, the cuddle bug right now. Well, yeah. Um, Meeple has always been the cuddle bug. Yeah. When we had her, like, when she was by herself. Yeah. She, she is such a cuddle bug. This one, he'll run around and then be the cuddle bug. Yeah. Meeple's, like, wondering what's going on with this uh, thing. <laughs> a TV TV Crocodile? Yes, Crocodile's so good. Uh, count me in for a donation to Pug Rescue. Thank you, Spanix. We learned so much about this organization. It's great. Um, they provide house, uh, find homes for pugs, uh, throughout the world. Uh, they partner, they recently partnered with a pug rescue in Korea and they brought a, pug, uh, a couple of pugs over. Um, they all over the US and you know, we're about an hour away. So it wasn't bad for, uh, it wasn't too bad of a drive for us, but yeah, it was totally worth it. They they have a lot of older pugs and pugs with special needs, uh, but there are a lot of great foster parents out there. They, you know, they foster a lot of these pugs and it's great. And we were thrilled to be able to adopt uh, Meeple and Mookie. So Meeple, everyone's saying hi. 
Uh, old Man Coaster, hello. Old Man, old man Coaster, um, I hope you're doing well. Um, thank you for joining us tonight. Um, yeah, this is Meeple. I've got Meeple, and uh, Michelle's got Mookie, who it looks like he's sleeping. Oh my gosh. No, he's <laughs> eyes, eyes open. open. Darby Games in the house. Darby Gaiman was here the other night. Oh, was it last night? Yeah, yeah it was last night. Last night, and uh, he got along with uh, <laughs> Mookie and Meeple this time. <laughs> Collect the camel pugs, yeah. Oh, uh, you know, I want to get it. I should start a pug cam, you know, <laughs> so when they're on the ground, I'll, I'll just have a cam uh, set up for the ground when they're chilling. They've got some very cute moments. Yeah. You know, I have to go back to work in person. So, um, Ruel keeps me abreast of what's going on with these yeah. two little guys. So I'll be... I'll one be, girl, one guy. Yeah, I'll be working along and then, you know, like this right now, Meeple will be on my lap. So I'm not like taking selfies. Look, the pug's here. And then sometimes I'll go, you know, um, take a break and go to the, the family room and sit on the couch. And both of them will jump up and just, like, smother me. It's I always send pictures of Michelle. It's oh, it's part of my job now, and, and I'm okay with it. <laughs> he sent me a picture of them sunbathing. <laughs> yeah. Earlier today, um, I took them out to, you know, do their business. And uh, it was a nice sunny part of the yard, front yard, you know, on the porch. And both of them just sat down, and then they laid down, and they fell asleep. I was like, oh, I... You know, okay, work can wait a few more minutes. I gotta stay out here with the pugs. Um, Spandex says, very absurd question. When Meeple misbehaves, are you able to say Meeple in a stern voice or do you end up laughing? Just, yeah, I, it's, you know what we use? We say no. Uh, they, they, they they understand they respond no. To no. They respond to that. But yeah, because there's no way I could keep a straight face saying Meeple. <laughs> you know, I can't even do it right now. <laughs> even Mookie, you know, Mookie is hard to say. And we've been mixing them up. Like, I'll start saying oh, yeah. Moople, Moople <laughs> or uh, what's the other one? Uh, Meepy or something like that. Or, yeah, we just start shortening it to Meeps and Mooks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I have to stop and think first. Yeah. Because um, they do look very similar, but um, I don't know if you can tell. Well, not now, but. Yeah. Um, oh, probably her head right here. You can see there's like a yeah, black stripe. Yeah, she's got a black stripe, kind of a faint black stripe all the way down her her torso mm -hmm. and this one's a little more blonde yeah and a little more like husky he's got more of like um bruno's build yeah almost like a like a french bulldog yeah yeah i mean he's definitely a pug but mm -hmm. just a little the other one's more dainty yeah yeah uh i want to say hi to um um uh, deadpan and uh, gator dave thank you for joining us friends good to see you here um yeah we're just hanging out enjoying our pugs and meeple is falling asleep in my lap Mookie is getting comfortable in Michelle's lap, and he's got his eyes closed. He's like, okay, I'm done. We're going to sleep. <laughs> it's, oh, it's adorbs. Oh, it scared me yesterday because we mm. walked the dogs, and the um, harness that came with him, like, it's Velcro, and it had an attachment, like, under his neck and then under his, you know, like, where his belly is. And little dog was a little wild when he took him for a walk, and... And he got out of his, his harness. Out. Yeah, we're like, oh no. I was like crying. Yeah, the, and the street's a little busy. I mean, thankfully there's no cars coming around. But yeah, no, Michelle chased him. You. He ran across the street, I ran back, and then right when he was running towards me and his sister, I just grabbed him. Um, but yeah, so you got you can't do that, buddy. You gotta stay stay uh, stay with your human. <laughs> and he's snoring. <laughs> and he's snoring. <laughs> uh, anyone else have bugs? I mean, you you know what we're talking about. So apparently this is gonna be the stream, just uh, hang out and, uh, with listen, our pugs. Listen to little boy uh, snore here. Snoring. Um, <laughs> yeah, we were just gonna hang out and uh, do Legos. Um, we were so close to finishing R2 and I uh, wanted to show you where we're at right now. So um, here's the keyboard. I'll get that out of the way, the mouse, the little thing on my jig here. But that's R2, he's just missing his dome and we started building the dome the other day. We've got our uh, pieces for this, the rest of the bag all neatly laid out in this thing here. And I think Mookie, oh, he, Mookie hey, wants baby. to take a look. Huh? Hey, he probably thinks these are little food containers. <laughs> yeah, old man coaster, yeah, that would be scary. Yeah, we, we weren't uh, too happy, but uh, <laughs> what's a Lego? We're here for Pugs, eh? right? <laughs> uh, we got the Pugs here, yeah. <laughs> it was really cute earlier. I said, hello, baby. And then this one did the head tilt. <laughs> yeah, the Pug head tilt, so cute. Hi. Oh, he is just locked in. I'm, both of these Pugs Hi. love Michelle. They're just locked in. Yeah. Hey, baby. Um, 
Uh, I'll, I won't get back to the Lego. I'm okay. totally getting distracted here. Uh, I mean, maybe we'll, we'll see how far. We're not going to stream very long tonight, folks. We do appreciate you hanging out. Uh, be sure, if you haven't already, join our Discord where we have more pictures. Of, I, I have a feeling I should, I'm going to be posting a lot of pictures soon. But I, I don't want to overwhelm anyone with pug photos in, in the Discord. But I've got some cute ones. <laughs> <laughs> You know, it's like so. You know, everyone talks about their child. Like, yeah. oh, you know, it's like, oh, look at our folks. Yeah, back in the day, you pull your wallet out and have all the yep, pictures. Yeah. Uh, Old Mac Coaster says, "Oh, love how you have the extra pieces of extras." Yeah, we re we found these to be super useful uh, yes. during our last stream, so we're going to continue using these. Uh, GP Glazer said, "We fostered one of our dogs before she joined our family." Oh, cool. While fostering, she ran away twice. Oh no! And both times, we received a call from the Humane Society. Letting us know that they had her. We didn't think that they would let us actually go through with the adoption, but they did. Oh, nice. Aww. That's great. Yeah, we were, you know, yeah, we, um, before we adopted these two, we had, we actually had, we were interviewed. Uh, we took, we had a Zoom call where we had to show them our, our living area and how the pugs would be housed. We filled out the questionnaire and we were like, gosh, you know, we hope we, we can adopt. And, you know, thankfully they were, you know, super cool and, um, they found in favor of us to to grow our family. Um, it, it's yeah, we're just like we've said, we're doubly blessed uh, to have Meeple and Mookie. For sure. And now Meeple is snoring. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how we're gonna do Legos like this. It's gonna be impossible. Oh, Meeple. Oh, do you want to go down? Okay. Oh, she's just trying to get comfy. She's trying to get comfy. Okay, yeah. so yeah, let's just get started. See what we can do. <laughs> yeah, we'll do what we can. We'll hang out. If y'all y'all want to hang out with us, and we'd appreciate it. Um, let me see. Put can I move R2 a little bit? Yeah, R2 can be moved around there. Yeah, we're so close to finishing R2. I, I really do hope we can uh, complete this uh, within a week or so. Um, again, the, I want to thank uh, Lucky Duck Games for the X-Trays. They, they were kind enough to send these. And... Um, these can, like, stack right there. Yeah, yeah, right? you can totally okay. stack on the... Um, on the lids. Lids, yeah. How about, thanks for reminding me. It's just one less pile to have. This yep. is very efficient. Yeah. These are perfect for Legos. They really are. Uh, I was so, you know, so pleased. I mean, if you don't finish, you know, whatever you're working on that day, it's mm -hmm. easy to just close these and yep. stack them and put them away. Yep. Okay. Uh, so according to this, we stopped off on either 440 or 441. I think you put the bark mark here probably for 441, huh? Sure. Okay. Okay, so what do we need? We need um, those, those two. Three. Okay, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two, three. Oh, this is a six one. We need four of those, and then I need we need eight of these. This isn't the right one though. Oh, yeah. One, two, three. We need the one that has eight, right? right that one right there. This has like other things. Oh, on that's it. A, oh, maybe that's. Oh no, eight of these. Oh wait, is this it? Oh, that could be it. Oh, I guess I should look at the correct color. Three. So four of them. Six. Seven, eight. There's only two of these. It says I need four. Four. Yeah. Keep keep looking. It could be something else. Let me, uh, Nightbot, I think, is off. Where are you at, Nightbot? I don't see these anywhere else. Disable Nightbot. Yeah, I'm gonna have to hold this one like a baby. Let's yeah. see if he sleeps out. Can you sleep this way, sweet baby? Oh, oh. Oh, you know what? We started building this one. Here. Oh, okay. Oh, we did? Yeah, look. It's this right here. Oh! Haha! <laughs> -ha, cool. Oh, hi. Hi, I'm Pucko. sorry. Yeah, you don't want to sleep on my shoulder like a baby? Okay, so no, we did okay. build 441. Okay. Oh, you know what? We have to add, add it to R2 now. Uh, and oh, we're built, okay. okay we're, we built the first one. Now we're building the second one. And then we're adding it to the head. So, woo! Woo! Snort, snort, okay, dog. Okay, so it looks like this in the picture. Okay, so this is going like that. Okay. Okay. And then a second one, which I'm finishing right now. <laughs> yeah, pugs in our lab. So sweet. Spanik says, I saw the news about the super upgraded castle of Burgundy. Um, 
the same day I got an ad for 3D printed root upgrades and I've got to admit I'm tempted by both. What are your thoughts on the wildly ex expensive and unnecessary game upgrades? <laughs> yeah, they are wildly expensive. I, you know, we talked a little bit. Oh, you know what? We built both of them already. I thought there were two. Yeah, there added. it is. I don't know. So well, I'm... it's the same thing. Hopefully yeah. we have to do this again. Uh, let's move to the next page and I'll answer that question in just a second. Um, because we, uh, Richard and I actually talked about it on the R and R show today. Uh, you know, if you can afford it, why not? I, it's definitely not a necessity. Um, I think the games play fine just as they are. One thing I am looking forward to the Castles of Burgundy upgrade though. I am hoping that this new edition is going to be colorblind friendly because the first one was not, the second one was a little better, but still had issues. Um, and then the third one, we, we shall see. I know it's supposed to have some miniatures like castles and stuff, which is totally unnecessary, but you know, it's a great game. I, I don't mind seeing that, but I don't think, I, I don't know. I don't want people to think you need to get this. You know what I mean? Like the, the game is readily available. Um, and I, even the old version that I still have, I still have like the first version I got, you know, or did I give that one away? I might have given it away because I had the new edition, but I still had to mark it up for my red, green color blindness. Cause I, I sort of went off on Steppenfeld today and you know, this is nothing personal, uh, but just talking about how his games, it's the design of the publishers that ultimately do it, but they always pick like different shades of green and tan and stuff I'm like, really? I mean, how are you going to tell that? It's just, it's ridiculous. And um, Rado and I were talking how, you know what? Stefan Feld needs to take a stand against that. He probably doesn't care, but he should throw his weight around a little bit. He's like, hey, you know, I've been, I'm a, this designer. People listen to me, like make my games colorblind friendly, you know? Uh, Spanning says, I hadn't heard that. And thank goodness I have a ton of issues with Castle Burgundy, especially with the tan light green. Yes. And even my friends who have 20-20 vision have trouble with some of those tiles. So, um someone like me red green colorblind or anyone else that has different colorblind uh issues it's a pain in the butt and it's a shame because that game is awesome one of my favorite games of all time but only after i marked up my copy um let me see can i help you out here um i'm looking for something like this all oh, the four buys oh, just kidding i found the piece i need okay ah okay so you can do that all around each corner yes. nice hi baby hey baby pug oh my goodness when i was getting our tax documents ready this one decided he needed to sit in my lap <laughs> it uh, was no fun yeah, that was not fun stuff okay let me just put that in right there and there's another gray one that looks just like hey, baby it. girl sagrada is also an amazing game that's actually unplayable spandex i'm glad you brought that up so in our Discord channel, I'm going to drop the link again, folks. So I'm going to keep doing it. Sorry, I'm such a spammer. Um, we have a solo challenge that goes on every two weeks. The current one is Sagrada. And I, when I looked at it again, I haven't played in a while, Spandex, I couldn't tell blue versus purple. They looked the similar, similar to me. So what I did, um, I ordered dice online. I found, I found the info. They're 12 millimeter dice that they use in Sagrada. And so what I did was instead of the translucent ones i needed new purple ones i got the opaque ones so yeah it may not look as pretty as the original version but it's playable now for me so the green i could probably swap out the green too because the green's a little similar to my eyes to uh, some of the other colors but yeah now it's totally playable so that's i recommend doing that if you can uh you know if you can afford it too i mean the the dice i got you know, from chessix on amazon it was like seven dollars and change for 36 of those dice and uh, Sagrada uses 18 dice, so I have basically another set left over. And maybe I'll just, you know, I, you can never have too much, too many dice. Didn't you buy like a pack of a hundred? I did buy a pack of a hundred. Glad, glad you brought that. <laughs> when we were playing a uh, Ryder Canizia's Decathlon, I figured we needed new dice. So of course we, we needed we needed yeah. new dice because you know, <laughs> I, there was a great deal on Amazon for a hundred six sided dice of multi colors. Oh, and with a bag and a uh, dice cup, it was like 10 bucks or $12. Like, I was losing money by not buying it, right? <laughs> How many times have I heard that? <laughs> Old Mac, I was glad we were able to catch a bit of the stream tonight. Good luck with our two. We have a long drive. Hey, have a uh, safe travels, Old Man Coaster. And again, I'm wishing you the best. Take care of yourself. And uh, we'll see you on Twitter. Uh, Spanish says, in the meantime, I just spent too much uh, on custom markets for our Arc Nova. Oh, Arc Nova. 
<laughs> I love that game. I played it once, and it's already top 50. My, it's going to keep going higher in my estimation. That game is fantastic. Um, and TVD says, everyone needs more shiny math rocks. Yeah, I, I'm okay with that. I, I'm math okay. rocks. Math rocks. <laughs> That's incredible. I, love I, it. I feel the need to... I feel the need to use that. Math rock. Well, in fact, one of the, um, not projects, but worksheets that the students have to do tomorrow has to do with the game board. Oh, really? Yeah. Um, so probability and mm -hmm. yeah. And yes, you know what? It does in fact use die. Oh, dice. Oh. 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 I'm glad I got a hundred I mean, dice. You can borrow some. <laughs> yeah, we need some of those math rocks. Math rocks. <laughs> Baby. Okay. Got these. Hi, baby. Oh, now Meeple's like, what are you doing? She wants me to be action too. I am missing some stuff. We don't have enough. Okay. Which one are we missing? Okay. I'll find it. So I need is another that gray 4. one 2? like this. Yes. Okay, gray ones. Uh is it this one or almost... Wait, hang on. let me put this one down. Speaking of putting down, do you want to go down? I think Hi, you... sweet girl. Do you want to go down or you want to sit? Okay. You can be here, baby. Um, we have these. I don't feel like I did this right. Okay, so this goes here. Um, a gray one that looks like this. That one's darker gray. Let me find that one. <laughs> Here's this baby. All right now. Here's the other baby. Cute. Hi, babies. The cutesies. Hi, pretty babies. Hmm. So one, two, three, we're missing that one, huh? We don't find underneath one of these. Okay, so this goes like that. Oh yeah, just a gray one to put here. I feel like that's wrong. Yeah, there's no other piece. This would be really sad. Like that. So here, did I take? Yeah, I wonder how they like count these mm -hmm. and then package them. We do have a bunch of extra ones I could look through there from previous um, bags. Um, you said something looked wrong. Can I take a look? Uh, in that corner where the red piece is, did I do that right? I mean, minus the um, oh, missing minus piece. The okay, let's see. This here, this looks good. This looks good. Oh, we're just missing that one piece. One, two, oh, yeah, it does look a little funky. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It's a different color. It's a different shade. But it's the exact same piece. Ah. Hey, Nicole. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, it is different. It has This one has like a little lip. Oh. Did you say that? No. Let me see if there, if there was a previous thing here. Okay. She hears the plastic. Oh, that's one thing with these little dogs. When you hear the plastic of just, you know, anything. Like you open a bag of, you know, like I open a bag of walnuts. They think it's, um, they think it's food. food. I open the little dishwasher packet bag <laughs> and they think it's food. Sweet baby boy. Wow, we, uh, we're missing a piece. That's a drag. Do you know where it is, Mooks? You didn't eat it, did you, Mickey? I was sleeping the whole time. <laughs> um, maybe it's. Oops. You think it'll make a difference? Well, it's gonna bug me if anything. Okay, stream's over. Yeah, stream's <laughs> over. You can't find this piece. Uh, let me check the bag of extra pieces. We have a bunch of extra pieces, and none of them are that piece. So. Nothing even close. Nothing even close. The closest is that one, uh, this one here. Well, actually, this one. 
What is this here? What do y'all do when you have uh, Mr. Freeze? <laughs> Spandex, I have powers. Oh, because Spandex says, okay, in bizarre, a bizarre uh, coincidence, I was opening a bag of walnuts, as Michelle said, opening a bag of walnuts. <laughs> <laughs> um, Look at this baby No, this, this won't work. It's off. Look at this baby. Uh, yeah, I don't know what to do. We are we are missing a piece of our Lego set, unfortunately. Get our money back. I know. Oh well, we didn't pay for it. <laughs> what are we gonna do? Oh, let's see. Okay, just to make sure nothing's like in the. What? Making chocolate chip walnut cookies. Ooh, Nine yum! Late by baking. Shoot. I don't see it. It's from your left foot. It was a big. Uh... Where are the tweezers? <laughs> yeah. Hey, baby dog. Let me get the tweezers out. Woo! Tweezers. So when Ruel was having his um, yard sale for uh, board games, our neighbor was also having a yard sale, but you know, regular yard sale, and. <laughs> I ended up buying some stuff. <laughs> um, I'm trying to like go minimalist here, but these were deals I just could not pass up. They were yep. selling a um, a cast iron skillet I got it for a dollar. Yep. And then what else did I get? A brand new uh, Brita water filter pitcher. They're filling the plastic. Um. We got a hand mixer because we have a hand mixer, but I don't know where it is. <laughs> we have the little attachments, you know, that spin around. Don't know where the other part is. So each item was a dollar. And then I got a spiralizer also in the box for a dollar. Good deals. Yeah. Can't pass those up. I know. <laughs> Two fifty six. Each time that's happened to me with Lego, it turned out that I'd use a wrong piece of order. That's what I'm afraid of. Oh. I don't want to have to take this whole thing apart. <laughs> There's a lot of little pieces in that one. Yeah, and I mean, I see one right here that could be it, actually. Uh, let me go back here. I'm going to leave that up there. If I go to this page. Right? I mean, these are things I'm going to use. T50 says, okay, those are good buys, Michelle. And the, um, the cast iron oh. skillet, it was in pristine condition. Like, did, did they cook on this? Because it didn't seem like it. But we were just talking about, um, you know, going to the beach and having a barbecue and using a cast iron skillet. And Found I was kind of like, oh. thank you, T50. Ah, this here should be that gray one, the light gray. Thank you, T50. You just solved the mystery. So, this one here was on top of this when it should have been this piece here. Wow. Ah. Chat saves the day. TVFD. Everyone, let's show some love for TVFD. <laughs> Save the day. Wow. Uh, so the thing is, how do you get this off? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to get this piece off. Oh, uh, Meepo, are you okay? Hey. Okay. Here, oh, you're falling down. That's fine. Okay, there you go. Baby. You keep on falling. Okay. Hi, so sweet girl. I take this one off like this. Her tail is straight. And then we put this one here. Yeah, there it is. This goes here. Uh, this is not food, baby girl. Yeah, there it is. Thank you, softening your razor. Boom. T Viv D saves the day. Okay. Now we flip this over. Wait, did I do it the right way? I believe I did. <laughs> uh, what step was that? That was step number. Oh, well, I'm looking on on the book here. Um, so this, if I'm looking this way. Yeah, look at that. And then we take the one that we're looking for. In the corner where the red piece. This one right here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Woohoo. Thank you, big girl. All right. Wow. TVD really <laughs> saved the day. There, <laughs> um, and then we go to step four, four, three, which I've got the eight ready for you if you'd like to do those. I would like to do those. Okay. okay let's see how much so, this little boy is going to move. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, so the red is going to be here. Let's give you want to see? Oh, hi, you hi, people. See? Okay, check it out. There, we'll show everyone. Give you a different view, folks, of what you're looking at right now. I've got two pugs here. 
There's Meeple. Hi, Meeple. Uh-oh. It's coming out. Hi, baby dog. Hi, baby. What? Are you trying to get on the table? Because that's <laughs> not happening. Yeah, you're not, you're okay, not, yeah, oh, get comfy there, baby. Go ahead baby. get comfy, baby. <laughs> this baby dog here. Oh, are you interested? These are Legos. Is it uh, out of the heck? Good for good to see you. Thanks for hanging out with us. We should um, find one that's a pug. Yeah, a Lego thing that's a pug. I found I found a small uh, Lego set that's a pug with a fire hydrant. It's sort of cute, but they didn't really. It was okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, maybe we should just do it freehand. Yeah. Do anyone? Does anyone out there do Legos freehand? You know, like in the olden days? <laughs> yeah. Uh, was anyone uh, in chat, do you just, do you have Legos that you just build and try to make stuff? Because we actually, I mean, I have a whole bin full of Legos yeah. that I used to use for my class when I taught. Ooh. Do you have the, um like the flat one? That's like I don't. A base? No, I don't okay. have that. So I had an idea. I'll talk to you offline because I, I want to, okay. it'd be like a little surprise for everyone. I, I'd like to do something with it. Oh, God. Uh, T fifty says my dog just uh, booped my phone when he heard Michelle. <laughs> uh, hi, baby dog. <laughs> hi, baby dog. And you too, baby yeah. dog. Oh, oh my Mookie. baby. Hi, Mooks. Hi, Mookie. Time rollers in the house. Hi, time roller. We're building R T D T Lego. Uh, so that was. Are you finished with that seven? Oh, you still finished it. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to just snap it on there. Yep. Okay. And okay, each corner gets one of these. Uh, okay, the Spandex does. Uh, there's a really cool account that shows techniques for making awesome mini landscapes and cities, and it's so much fun. Ooh. Yeah, because I know you have like a ton of Legos, right? Well, I'm going to call it a ton, but it's a very large bin of just, you know, random Legos. Yeah. I don't even know where I got them from. Okay. I'm, just I'm, as a teacher, you just collect them, or right? Collect so many things. Yeah. So many things. And I think all teachers are hoarders. Because, you know, when you find a good deal, <laughs> yep. you got to get it. You got to jump on it. That's right. Okay, so that was step 443. Uh, step 444, we're going to need these long ones again. I think. This. Oh, did we rebuild? Uh, this might be the one we rebuilt. Which was, where is that sucker? No, did I lose it again? That one that we had already built. I know what you're talking about. I don't know where it is. Come on, baby. But these are obviously different. Why would we have built those ahead of time? Yeah. Okay, that one's right. This one's right. This one is wrong. Or, you know, you know what? We, we took those pieces. Okay, I got it. We were taking those pieces, so let me. I'm gonna redo this. When the pandemic started, I started building a. Uh, uh, oh, 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 sorry, oh, 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 sweet girl. Oh. <laughs> okay, baby girl. Sorry. Hi. It's a dangerous live stream, baby girl. <laughs> you might fall when you're half asleep. I started building a two size Lego a clue mansion and got seven out of the nine rooms done. Whoa! Wow. <laughs> AB Troop. Oh, AB Troop. Uh, thank you for uh, uh, letting us know. We got an incoming um, raid from the Brothers Murph. Appreciate it. We'll, we'll say hello. We, we're going to keep the pugs here. And there's the raid. <gasps> Friends, welcome, Brothers Murph and company. We are Ruel and Michelle, Tabletop Tonight. We're joined by our pugs, the newest newest additions to our family. This is Meeple. This is Mookie. And that's Mookie. Uh, Meeple, obviously, mm -hmm. for, we're a board game family, so here's Meeple. Yeah. And we are also Dodger fans, so of course we had to Mookie. Yeah. But Nick and Mike, thank you for the raid. Um, I forgot what you're all playing. You were playing like an older game, I think, or well, old for board game. Uh, something not like the the current hotness but um yeah hello everyone uh board game free hi these are our pugs um me well let's just talk about our pugs we're, what we're doing right now we usually play board games here uh but we are uh, streaming our build of r2d2 leg of the uh, lego r2d2 we're almost done with it but we, we have to share our pugs these are the newest members of our family we adopted meeple two weeks ago um she is almost two years old 
And this is her brother. It's a bonded pair of pugs. They're not from the same litter, but uh, Mookie, who has fallen asleep right there in your hands. Oh my gosh. Uh, he's about a year and a half, and um, he's not even resting his his. He just, on he's me. just got his eyes closed. So, Spandex, thank you so much for the gifts, folks. Gift, 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 gift. I I want to do the gift song, but we got our hands full right now, so we owe you one, Spandex. Thank you for gifting it, uh, those subs. Mm -hmm. The Time Roller, Gear Dave, Skronik, uh Kate Invader, and Variant Hex. I appreciate that, friend. We always uh, we we do really do appreciate your support. So, so thank you so much. Um, want to say hi to everyone here. Kawhi is here. Stacy, everyone. Oh, hi, Stacy. Sarah um, uh, Hell's 13, good to see you in here. Uh, Drew Scrolls, a first time chatter, says Castle Burgundy. That's right. We were just talking about Steppenfeld a few minutes ago. And yeah, these are our pugs. Um, Meeple's just looking at Mookie. She's like, why are you asleep? No, she's closing. Oh, she's closing her eyes too? Yeah. Yeah, so they're, they're in their nice chill mode right now. They are a little earlier, they're a little, uh, getting a little crazy. But um, Orange Crush, good to see you. Uh, hello, friends. Hi, sorry, don't talk much about cute pug. Oh, thank you, uh, Drew. Appreciate that. Um, we so I was continuing the story here. We adopted Meeple uh, two weeks ago, and uh, Mookie earlier this week on Sunday. He came, so he's been part of that. Oh, well, he's only been here for like two days. But <laughs> he's made himself home. Uh, at home you know, for at sure. home, yeah. Wow. <laughs> we love having these uh, two uh, two pups in the house. Um, I don't know. What, what else can we say about these puggos? Oh, they're just so cute. And they have their, their little things that they do. Yeah. Like, um, I have to think. Okay. Meeple, she'll sit at the dinner table. Like, if you leave yeah. the chair um, pulled out, she'll sit on the chair. Like, she's yeah. ready for dinner. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> she's licking Mookie's oh. face. Oh. 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 Are you kissing your brother? Yeah. Kissing your brother? Oh. They're, they're really good with each other. I mean, they, they'll, they like, uh, play growl you know nothing too serious they're not snapping each other i mean they're definitely a bonded pair and it was cute when we went to go pick up uh mookie uh, michelle had to go to the restroom real quick at the at the pug rescue and i had meeple and all of a sudden i heard you know i heard some pugs barking and it was this guy barking to her and she was barking right back at him it was so funny the the lady who was helping us said oh my gosh they're totally talking to each other i was like yeah they are <laughs> it's hilarious um but yeah team 50 the kisses are so cute and yeah these two oh mookie's snoring now. <laughs> but yeah we love our pugs we're, we're so we've said it before uh we'll say it again we are doubly blessed um you know we had lost our pug bruno last year and uh, we took some time off of course to mourn and you know we like to think that bruno is our pugs guardian angel pug right now so um meeple and mookie they're a newest uh, addition to the family um yeah now she's got her tooth she's just looking at the table here um meeple and mookie joined me and daryl last night for a few minutes uh, michelle brought them in and it was really cute um uh just to hang out with them during our during our live stream last night but oh pugs so sweet yeah so what we're doing, um, again, thank you for hanging out with us. It's a real chill stream tonight, folks. Um, we appreciate it if you lurk or just hang out. And what we're doing is building Lego R2-D2. Uh, this is bag 11 of 13. We're finishing this up from the other day. I think we'll just get through bag 11 and call it a night, and we'll save bags 12 and 13 for another night. Yeah. You know, because we got to go cuddle with our pugs a little <laughs> more off, off camera. Uh, but yeah, uh, appreciate y'all uh, sticking by and uh, hanging out. Uh, a shout out, big shout out to Nick and Mike. Folks, by the way, did you know on Monday, the 18th, next Monday, well, we, oh, less than a week away, Nick and Mike are going to be here in studio. We are going to be playing the Paradox Initiative. So please come back next week. Uh, we're going to start early. It's Gaviola Game Night. So it starts. it's an all-day thing. It starts at 11 a.m. Pacific, uh, 2 p.m. Eastern. And we have a bunch of special guests coming over as well. So that's going to be a lot of fun. And you're gonna have, we're going to have pugs. I'm sure they're going to make their appearance as well. So appreciate that. Uh, sorry to speak up. This is not a chill stream. There was a lot of drama with a misplaced piece. Or that's right, Spanish. <laughs> I was I was sweating it. But thankfully, T Viv D gave us a little idea of where it could be. She said that you know when they do uh, things, it's using a wrong piece earlier, and there was a misplaced piece. So whoosh, yeah, <laughs> crisis averted. Um, thank you for the lurk, folks. Uh, thank you, Kawhi. Appreciate it and. Um, I don't know what to do. I know. I, I, I don't want to wake him up. Yeah, he is like I'm not, out. I'm not comfortable. He's very comfortable. <laughs> oh, baby okay. bugs. Okay, sweet baby. All right. So oh. um, Michelle had finished that up, I oh. believe. Yes, she did. 
Oh my god. And we're going to build this next piece okay. here. Okay. All right, Meeple. Um, I need to try to find Meeple. I need to take these apart. So I'm going to take this apart. No, it's not. It's not a snack. Um, how do I take these apart like this? Oh, do you want to go down? Okay, she wants to go down. Okay, Meeple. Hey, sweet. There you go, baby girl. All right. And now Mookie's awake. He's like, where's my sister? You want to go play with her? Yeah. You want to play with Meeple? Oh, no. Nope. He no. wants to stay with his mama. <laughs> and it's cute when, you know, they're... I work from home and uh, Michelle's back in the classroom and it's cute. Like, they totally look for Michelle the entire time. Uh, they'll they'll saddle for me, but we know they're, they're mama's uh, pugs. Well, I do appreciate that you send pictures. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta keep keep track of your babies, you know. Hi, sweet girl. Yes. She wants a treat. Uh-oh. Is it treat time already? And now Mookie is awake. He's like, did I hear treats? <laughs> okay, so I'm going to do this one here. This goes here with this hey, piece. Sweet girl. I need four of these, which I have here. So um, let's, here, I'll show this on camera, actually. I'm on step 444. Uh, there's 444. I got have this. Just I've got this. You're you. <laughs> this goes here. This goes here. Hi, baby. Oh my gosh. We need a pug cam. This. If I had my other chair, I would have both of them on my lap, but I don't have armrests here. Oh, the armrests, yeah. I don't want to drop one of them. <laughs> She's so cute. <laughs> hey, Mookie. Hi, sweet girl. Hi, sweet boy. Okay, so I'm building this here. This is. So we originally thought we were getting two girls. That's right. Because um, their original names were Danny and Louise, and but they spelled Danny with one N. So we're like, oh, that's gotta be you know, like the girl or the feminine, you know, version of. But then we, <laughs> we signed the adoption papers. <laughs> it said one male, one male pug and one female pug. Yeah. <laughs> and we were like, oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah, right, right on. Cool. Come on, sweet girl. Okay, so sweet boy. This. Pugos. Maybe we should just get them their own chair. <laughs> yeah. We need a pug chair. Yeah. And I have a pug chair and y'all can just chill. Mm -hmm. Chill in the chair. Chill in the pug chair. Okay. Oh, you know what? I forgot to do this one step. So this step here I had. Oh. Um, this so my pants is, slippery. This one, or hey, sweet one, boy. This one. I need to get comfortable here because this is not comfortable for me. Okay. And this <laughs> one's gonna go over here, Come here baby. like this. Hi. Hello. Right there. Okay. And then well, this don't one get here. comfortable yet because I'm not comfortable. I've got this, and it's gonna go in here. Hi, sweet girl. I'm do it like this. Oh, she's just chilling on the floor. Yeah. Hi, sweet girl. Hey, Meeps. Of course, it's Meeps and Mooks. <laughs> Meeps and Mooks. Okay. And we continue on to 440. Hello, baby. <laughs> You're going to do it? He, he does the head tilt. He looked at me. The pug tilt. Hello, baby. He did it. <laughs> I don't know if you could see it from that angle, though. One. Hey, okay. Hello, baby. No. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, sweet girl. She's wagging her tail. She loves wagging that tail. Are you interested in what's happening here? It's okay. R2-D2. So one, R2 two. two. So now I'm building this one here, 446. A one, two, and then I turn it over. And I add three, <laughs> four. And I turn it over again. So, then one like so. What are you doing, sweet girl? I mean, sweet boy. Did I miss one? There's three of these, so one. <laughs> putting his little puggy two, paw. Right here. Your puggy three. paw was on camera. Okay, I'm worried. Does this go on top of this? Or let's see. So it's going to go here okay, okay this does go on top like this and then this put this down right here bum bum bum, bum yeah well, what was that 
What was okay. that noise? Then we go to 447, uh, which we're going to take one of these. You want to go with your these, sister? Put it right in the middle. Go. Oh, what other parts do we need? So one, one. Oh, we need four of these. Okay, so we're building multiples of this. So four of those. One, two, three, four of those. I'm done with that. Hey, baby. And then we need eight of these, which I believe we have. Two, four. Boom. Yep. Six, eight. Get rid of this Hi, one. Hi, Meeple. And then four of these, which we have right here. We can get rid of this Did one. you call me? <laughs> oh, Meeple. Yes, this baby. goes here like this. Hi. And then we're going to place the those roundy thingies again these are technical legal Legal terms, terms. <laughs> I hope you all understand this was that in the manual there yeah roundy lego <laughs> thingies look at this dog what are you doing <laughs> oh my gosh can we see him let's see you can sort of see him he's he's resting he's got his, his face on the, uh, yeah table he's resting here. his face on the table i guess i gotta do this four more times <laughs> or three more times is that funny? Funny pug. So yeah, we're gonna just do this, uh, finish this bag, folks, and then we'll uh, send you, we'll raid someone else, because uh, we're gonna go hang out with the pugs off camera, and we got other things to do as well. But I do want to thank you all for hanging out with us tonight. Um, we will eventually finish R2. We, not sure when, but... Uh, <laughs> it's soon, though. It we're almost soon. there. Yeah, and I really want to finish it, because you know what's coming next, folks? We finish our two, then we got to get the light and sound set that uh, a third party uh, company makes, which is awesome. And I didn't know I needed it until I saw it. And <laughs> <laughs> I do want to thank uh, the gentleman on Twitter who uh, pointed it out to me. He had also just recently gotten into Legos and he had, he had done the R2 and he found, he, showed, he sent me the link to that light and sound system. And I was like, oh boy, that thing is awesome. <laughs> okay, so we built those four. Uh, we continue to step 448. Uh, so we turn so it over. Turn it over. Turn around. <laughs> okay, that goes there. Uh, that's there. Oh, yep. Excuse me. Okay, that's correct. Um, what are we going to... Okay, does it say... Okay, it didn't say to place these... Oh, no, we are supposed to place those things. So this goes here. It's going to go here, 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 and here. Okay, easy enough. She got a toy. She got a toy? Yeah, she got her ladybug. Oh. I don't know, they might fight now. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, they have a lot of toys from Bruno. Bruno left them a plethora of toys. And uh, they, they enjoy them, for sure. <laughs> okay. I almost bought the board toys today. Oh, really? The Petco and... I don't know, they always have the impulse items that, you know, the register. Oh, yeah, yeah. There were two for five dollars and you know, I went in, I grabbed two of them and I was like, No, no, they have enough. <laughs> you know, when those are all well, maybe one of them <laughs> is all messed up and unable to be played with, mm -hmm. then I will replace. <laughs> Stacey ever done every now and then I get a <laughs> little bit rested when I do something. Well, yeah. Um Hefe, do you know what a plethora is? <laughs> Silver Metal Towers Mouse. Hey, Matt, good to see you here. Um, I am trying to find, um, by the way, folks, if you don't follow Silver Metal Tower, you know, I, I'm, I, I always forget to do this, but I do want to send a special shout out to Matt because he's awesome and you really do need to be following his streams production wise and just his, uh, the way he hosts is, it's awesome. And we are so happy to have him be part of TLN. Who's going to be on TLN? Uh, glad you asked. There is a command here that I press here. People could check out the schedule right there because I don't even know um, who's on it. I can't tell you off the top of my head. But uh, we will be on on the Saturday. And um, t a game TBD. I I'm working on the game right now. Silver Metal says, uh, you got me to want to do... Oh, totally. Yeah. It's funny. Matt had shown... Um, we were talking the other day. I think it was... Yeah, Matt. It was Matt. And he said, did someone say Lego? And he takes a photo and said it was like all kinds of Legos and stuff. Because, you know, he has a, a kid. And, uh, <laughs> Don't step on him. I say you do it, man. I I, I say you do it. Uh, it's so relaxing and fun. And Michelle and I, this is the first one we've done as, an, as adults. And we are loving it. Okay, so this ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving it. No, is that what it is? Is it that? Where, I, don't I don't know. There's a little dog licking my foot. 
Okay, so I take this. Hi, baby girl. This one's gonna go here. Is that how you do it? No, that Anise. can't be right. Anise. Maybe I got the wrong one. No, it's this and this. <laughs> and then this. Okay, what am I doing? Hello, I've got one of these, one of these. Hello, baby. Hello, baby. Oh, oh, let's see if he does it when you do it. Hello, baby. He's just staring at me. Like, what are you talking about? Uh, let me bring this over Hello, here. Hello, baby. So I've got to put this on this baby. piece. Hello, baby. How am I going to do? Oh, it's going to go on top that like too, this. Baby. Yes. Okay. Okay, that goes like that. And then this is going to go inside here. Yep. Okay, Ooh. cool. And then this is going to go over here. I put that there. And then, does this go, where is this? Yeah, then this will go right here. Maybe okay. I should just let him sleep right here. So we did that. Sleep on the table. <laughs> so Ma has a plethora of Legos. Uh, so now this one is going to go, uh-oh. Maple. Now I'm worried. Thanks, sweet girl. One, one. What would happen if I just let you slide down my lap? Slide. <laughs> He's trying not to slide. Okay. Just about done here, folks. Ah. Ah, so close. So one and two. Why is there? There's. Okay, now. Oh, no. We're putting together these two. Ah, you, you tricky Lego, you. So one goes here. Goes here. Just FYI, Meeple looks like she's gonna step on your pedals there. Oh, oh she moved. <laughs> okay, so this goes here, Thank and then we're gonna girl. place this, turn this around, turn around. Uh, this one goes. Monique had a really funny like thread going on Facebook. Let me find it. Um, and that's being Freak Geek Girl. Okay, we have like one, two, three, four, five extra pieces, which is worrying me again. I don't like having this many extra pieces. <laughs> okay. Oops. Okay, we, we can figure that out um, after the stream. Uh, do you think that's the most played karaoke song? I I always thought the most, what, what is the biggest karaoke song? It's like that one. Um, Hotel California. Hotel California. Well, at least in our household, Hotel California <laughs> is like one of the most played. Oh, because of me. The other one, um, I think it's Neil Diamond. Oh yeah, Sweet Caroline. Sweet Caroline. Sweet yeah. Caroline. Bum, 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 bum. Bum. Everybody. <laughs> Everybody. Welcome D20 Woodworking. Thank you so much for the raid. We appreciate it. My name is Ruel. It's my wife Michelle. Hello. This is our pug Mookie. We have excuse me, another pug Meeple who is Meeple. She's right here. She's down here. Um, but Mookie is just hanging out with Michelle. Um, we adopted both Mookie and Meeple recently. Excuse me, just within the last two weeks, and we're thrilled to have him here. Uh, Meeple, do you want to come back on the stream? Uh, she'll maybe she'll join us in a second, but first time chatter. Thank you. Uh, let us know what you're up to uh, D20 woodworking um, Appreciate it and TVD has just gifted a uh, Sub to our friend soften your razor and now that my hands are free. I can do this <coughs> We do analog alerts here folks. So we have an analog alert and this is also for um, Oh my gosh, who was our friend that uh, gifted the other it was um, uh, spandex uh, also gifted a, a bunch of new subs so we have renew uh, gifted subs Thank you, TVMD. Thank you, uh, Spandex3000. And um, I'll do it for both of us because Michelle's got her hands full. Uh, whenever we do gift subs, we say, gift, 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 gift. You know what that is, Meeple? Or Mookie? Uh, Mookie's like, what? And Meeple came running in. That's the gift song. Um, so we do analog alerts. So uh, that is uh, one of them. Uh, D20 says, just finished some Marvel Champions. Nice. Very nice. Uh, let me see if I want to catch up on all this stuff there that we might have missed. Uh, we had a recent follow. Oh, D20 actually followed us uh, earlier today. So thank you, D20. Um, another analog alert we have is Felicia the follow fish. Whenever someone follows us, Felicia comes up, swims around, and then she says hello to everyone. Then she swims away. And all of us, including everyone in chat, we say, Bye, Bye Felicia. Felicia. Thank you for the follow. D20 Woodworking. Also, Wizard Styles followed a while ago. And uh, Y2J Crisis as well. And Jeremiah Hammer, Matt Liza, 
Marble TV and so forth. So thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> yeah, and Silver Bell just swims in and leaves. Thank you for the by Felicia's in chat. Always good to see that. Thank you, Bree. And uh, friends, um, we've got a few extra parts here which have me worried, but we're going to take care of that off camera. Um, we do want to thank you again for hanging out with us. I'm going to find someone to raid, and then I will be back tomorrow uh, with a solo stream. First thing in the morning, it is One Player Wednesday. And so uh, what I'm going to do is... Um, as part of our Discord channel, which you can join there. It's a family-friendly Discord channel. Uh, we do solo challenges every couple of weeks, thanks to our friends James and Legends. I'm going to be playing Sagrada, and I have, um, I'm have i going to have it all laid out here. We're going to play a solo game and see how high I can score. It's a friendly competition. It's not like, you know, hardcore uh, challenge uh, in our Discord, but it's just a lot of fun, and I am cracking up at Mookie right now. Look at Mookie. He's got his head on, chin on the table, and he's like, what is going on? What is this streaming business you're talking about? And Michelle's going to take a selfie with him. Uh, Herb's Gamut has a delicious uh, honey game. Okay, yeah, we will. Uh, thank you, Matt. We are going to raid Herb's uh, Gambit right now. And let me get that set up. And uh, appreciate you all uh, hanging out with us tonight as we continue our Star Wars Lego build. Honey Bee, yes. Honey Buzz. Honey Buzz. Um, let's get that going. Yeah, so we've got two more bags. We've got bags 12 and 13. We're all done with R2. We're basically, the body is complete. We're just uh, finishing up R2's dome right here. And then let's send some love, though, to Herbs. He's a great streamer, a good guy. And let me get that ready here. Herbs Gambit, there he is. He is streaming now. Um, Michelle, anything before we get going? I know. I think we're definitely more productive on... The Lego front when the puggies aren't here. <laughs> yeah, but that's okay. I'm okay with it. Uh, so there's Mookie, Meeple's Raygon. On behalf of everyone here at Gabby, or at Gabby, Gabby Little Game Night slash Tabletop Tonight slash Lego Livestream, have a great night, everybody. And Bye. oh, stick around for the raid. I, I, let me press the raid button and uh, we'll be raiding in just a second. Uh, five, four, three, two, one, and so forth. Bye, everybody. Bye.